Hello. <clears throat> Hello everyone. Zena Zimmer here. And welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem Free Houses. Part 1. White clouds. Red wolf moon. The flame in the darkness. Hoarfrost now graces treetops and open fields alike, and an icy chill blown in from the north of Fargus like it's the land. All of Fodland's creatures begin to settle in for a long winter. The setting sun bathes the full winter coat of every wolf in a foreboding scarlet glow. Hunters can now spread the word that the red wolves are back on the prowl. Last time, well, we had the Battle of Eagle and Lion. This time, who got a pair for some pretty, pretty heavy things. If it loads. We got some gold. Gold. That's what we're dealing with. Is there no chance it's an infectious disease? There are no absolutes in medicine, but the chances are extremely slim. Restless movements, fits of violence, becoming bedridden, or even impossible to wake. With symptoms that varied, there are only a few possibilities. It's either a mixture of poisons or magic. And dark magic at that. You're talking about Ramire Village, aren't you, Manuela? Oh my, if it isn't Gerald. Tell me, what was the first thing you heard? Everything, after you mentioned that it's not likely an infectious disease. My child and I owe the people of Ramire Village. If something's happening there, we must help them. We scouted the area ourselves. Speak with the knights, hear what they have to say. I must go. Thank you for your help, Manuela. You know, I'm more than willing to go with you to Remire Village. After all, I owe you my life. If you'd like, I bet we could even manage the mission all by ourselves. Just the two of us. <laughs> That's nice of you. Professor! A bit of a tease, are we? A girl could get used to this side of you. Nice try, but I'll be going to the village as well. Enough nonsense. It's time to move out. <sighs> as you like. Goodbye, Gerald. Goodbye, Professor. I'll be in my office making preparations. What about you? If you have the time, it would be helpful if you could go ahead and talk to the knights. Hey! What's wrong? I'm okay. If anything feels off, return to the infirmary. No need to just grin and bear it. Got it? Ugh. What could have caused such dizziness? I felt it too. Actually, I felt that way before. Interesting. Though, we start off instructing instead. So, we won't be able to instruct many people this time. However, it's just enough. Hilda? Might as well max out her axes at this point. <sighs> Leonie? I'm getting. I will. Thank <laughs> you. 
because she's not gonna get some ranks up. I might as well rank her up a bit. Nope. Not what I was wanting to do, but oh well, she's being all put into a 40. Uh, Raphael. Let's try and raise that was your flying abilities. Plane. I would like Cutting Gale. Oh. Perfect. No need. Nice. Okay, let's check group tasks. Still the same. Uh, let's check goals first. Mm, yeah, everyone's going like a, how I want them to. Ignatz might need it. Marianne and Ignatz. Okay, group tasks, Skywatch, Ignatz, Marianne, begin ledger. Professor, may I ask you a question? Sure, Flynn. You should have an honest talk with your brother. Uh, I see. I would have thought that would be best. But we're gonna get a lot. Oh, that's nice. Hey there, Professor. No. Tomas doesn't seem to be here. Oh well, that's fine. I've been researching the hero's relics a lot since we last spoke to him. I found out something interesting. Something. Interesting. It's about the connection between crests and the hero's relics. The crest stone of each relic is carved with a specific crest, the one that has the ability to wield it properly. The crests are the keys. You need the right one to safely use a hero's relic. The only thing I can't figure out is, why doesn't the sword of the creator have a crest stone bearing a crest? I have one in the past. Precisely. At least, that's my current guess. There's more. I believe the crest stones might be the source of the relic's inhuman power. When Miklon transformed into a black beast, he was taken over by something that originated from the crest stone. And the crest stone was on his body. It all seems to add up. Now, look at this picture I found in the library. That creature is called the Immaculate One, who was supposedly sent by the goddess to save the followers of Seros. You see the pattern on its brow and the faint circular boundary? Isn't it possible that's a crest stone? If all this is true, then crest stones are what power the ability to assume massive forms like that of the Immaculate One. And maybe the hero's relics can harness that transformative power. Oh, it is you. Have you seen Tomas recently? No such luck. I was hoping to speak with him myself, but he seems to be out on the town. I see. Well... Hmm? Where did you find that picture? It was in the library. Why do you ask? Is it something my youthful eyes shouldn't be seeing? No, of course not. However, that is not part of this library's collection. It must belong to Tomas. It would be problematic if it got mixed in with the other books. I will take possession of it for now. Take it away where no one can see it, you mean. What was that? Well, that's what Tomas said. He said records that the monastery doesn't approve of tend to disappear. Tomas said that? Preposterous. I have far too much to accomplish to waste time with this foolishness. He was certainly in a hurry. I wonder if he's off to confront Tomas. Well, he took the picture, so I guess that's that for now. I'll see you later, Teach. Food for So, the church is hiding something after all. Some massive secret about relics and crests. A secret that must have something to do with the professor's true identity. Hmm.
It's Linhart's birthday. We'll do nothing. With you, I can. Yes, let's do our best. That wasn't so bad. Perfect. Okay, so I guess won't need more. Aha! Uh -huh. I'm getting it. Hades. I think I get it. Aura. Really good. Now we'll see what things, what things, what paralogs we've got. Auto save. But we won't actually go to them. Oh, we finally got Tales of the Red Canyon and Death Toll. Oof. We'll be having to do a lot. So. Sadly, we won't be able to do much more. Hey, I know you figure medicine is all about, but Matt. Let's recruit you. You want me to? You just say the word. Don't. Worry. It's only. And now we can go recruit Hanuman as well. So we can recruit one, we can recruit the other. Cultivate. On snail. Santhiel. One snail. Hmm. <laughs> oh. Felix. You know, but why? <laughs> uh. Oh. I have a request. Okay, we won't be able to do all of the requests. All right. In this quest. You can't if I as you were that want. Hey now. I have a favor to ask. Yeah, we're we'll going to do Shamil's version. <sighs> Professor. I hope you're up for a challenge. <laughs> right, this one. Hello there. We'll do that <laughs> soon. Let me continue. I can offer nothing more than this. I am in your debt, Professor. Crew. Just, of course, I have to be, and then I'd never get. Of course. Okay, so it goes all the way over there, so we'll just wait even longer. Please, could you let me have that? Here, fantastic! Thanks, Professor. You have no idea how... Okay, that should be fine. I assume you know by now. Still, I have a... I have something to ask of you. Okay. So, we've got to find more stuff. How to bake sweets. I could use your help. Someone in her position. Ah, uh, yes. Very subtle. Very hey. subtle. We'll ignore that for now. 
because we still got more to do and it's best to do that give it back stuff once we've done out for her professor do you ever wish to hide it was half a year gifts I appreciate and really Cyril professor want to trade me what you're holding thanks professor this is great and that's why Hello. we can give it to Catherine we'll eventually give what we'll get in this dumb quest well done you have my thanks He'll come back to you. Pardon me. Mercedes. Hello, Pri would you mind trading it with me? Oh, thank you so much. I'll be sure to take great. Sorry, but we're still not recruiting. Uh huh? Impressive. Thanks. Too much of a bother. Thank you so much. I'll treasure it forever. Seems a little weird. Linhart will want this That's though. That's a nice thing you have there. Why don't you trade it for this? Excellent doing business with you, Professor. Two tone wet stone. I've always wanted to say. That's what we want. And we'll be giving it to Shamir because, sadly, the bow. It's currently a better thing. You brought it, Professor? How? You can't give it here. Excuse me. I asked first. Here you go, Shamir. Sure. You made the right choice. Thanks. Now. Before we forget. What? And yes. This is a thing. Pay attention to all the students. Wait, what? I shouldn't be doing one damage. I should be doing. You've got to be joking. Oh, you've got to be kidding. Yeah, I'm going to lose this. Through no fault of my own. Literally, randomness. Alright, I might as well just max out everyone while I'm out. Ah. You've been Oh, supports. Oh, I've gotta wait until time skip. If this doesn't work, I'm just Yeah, I'm going to reset this because, oh, I'm going to need to. There is no other way to do it. Come on, a little quicker game. Cause... I effectively just got screwed because they put a heavy unit as the first enemy I've got to face. It's like, yeah, that's fair. That's clearly fair.
Leone. Hilda. And let's get everyone food. That it's Excuse me, second. Yeah, we'll give it to Flame. Then we'll fish, and then we'll. I didn't bathe. expect much from the dining hall, but. This is nearly. getting some we're getting some fish some goldens or so fish And the final one. All right, sauna. Sauna boss. Ignatz, because he's gonna need it. Four. We have some renown. Let's see if we can spend it. Depending on how much renown we have. Need something. Is this one? We might be able to get some faith. You're all Is this one? That's about it. You're all set. Get a 4A. See you again soon. Yeah, there's nothing else we can do. <sighs> Instruct manually. Instruct. Ignatz. I it's fun. No. I 
Ray. Claude doesn't really need it. Lawrence will need it. Marianne might. Hilda also might. Flame definitely does. Because she needs to get to. I would like to. B rank. No. Tasks will keep raising of big mats. Professor. Nope. You're not even close to becoming a holy knight. I'll come a Grand Mori. I thought we did. It's starting. the hang of it. Well worth the effort. Good job. <sighs> now it is time to fight. Battle. Oh, great. We've also got oil and war. Tails the Red Canyon first and then Death Toll because that has our students. Hmm. What was that name again? What's on your mind? Oh, this is frustrating me to no end. I simply can't recall. Oh, I have it. Xanado. Xanado the Red. Canyon. That's it. It was not long ago that we and still I somehow managed to forget. What about it? Well, that place brought back some fragments of my memory. I cannot help but wonder why. I feel we must return to find some answers there. Let's begin. Yes, you are right. For as the saying goes, there is no time like the present. Where's our professor going all alone like that? I hate not knowing what's going on. <sighs> okay, that's it. Let's gather the others and get to the bottom of this. You want to follow our teacher? What a pain. Ugh. But I guess I'm dying of curiosity too. Yes, it is all coming back to me. This structure. Oh, but it's as though my memories are clouded. The most important pieces are obscured. But I once called this home. I have no doubt. I seem to recall something on the other side of that wall. I cannot see it, but I can still feel it. It is not my imagination. I know this to be true. We are already deep within this valley. <laughs> What was that awful sound? It was a terrible scream. Yes, and that was not a normal beast, but a huge and terrifying one. Look, there, at the entrance of the valley, a giant shadow. Well, we've got ourselves into a fine mess. 
Let's see if we can break ourselves out. Marketplace. Italian Guild. For the only Ceres Pegasus. Core. Hire for myself. Actually, give that to look at. How we're set up. We've got a chest here. Oh, problem is Leonie is definitely going to need experience. Begin the battle. Defeat the enemy commander. By a claw fall, we lose. What is it now? Those hungry wolves. That howl must have riled them up. We have no choice but to fight our way out. Give it your all. It was the right move for us to follow Teach. But however you look at it, we're in a tough spot now. Wolves, hawks, not to mention a demonic beast guarding the canyon's entrance. Oh, we should never have come here. Don't say that. But what's a demonic beast doing here? Is it a stray? Even Teach would have trouble out here all alone. Let's help out before we're down one professor. First things first, we need to reunite with Teach. Hurry up, everyone. Claude and Joker. Right now, we are in a tough spot. The good news is, almost everyone can hit. So, let us. Ready and willing. Ready Let any time. Use Ignat to get a gambit. This should work. Further we can get. Let's get to it. God, really? I'm trying to think. Who, who is me? I stand ready. Let Kiki's us away. Flame, but she can't hit. I guess he'll looking for The problem is it's gonna hair twice. Which I'm not exactly a fan of. Javelin. I'm not a fan of being hit twice. So I'm probably gonna have to rely on Marianne to stay out of range. Jesus, Marianne. Wit steel. 
I got this. Steel axe. And now. Never Boom. estimate an outsider. Leave it to me. Stay focused. Thicket is the best place to stay, and even then, it's not even that great. Especially since we've got another wolf coming from behind. Predictable. Okay, good. Now let's move. And let's charge. Assembly. Underestimate us. Mostly because it'll um, help us just to finish off and gain her level. I think. Yeah, I'm definitely tougher. Shatter. Rescue Marianne. Regrouped, which is good. Though it's not good, is the fact that this guy is coming at us. Onslaught. I have an idea. Push them back. How done this? Yeah, because of how done this, I'm gonna have to rely on my to finish it off. Yeah. There we go. There's Claw at level 19. Okay. So that does mean probably.
Yeah, might as well just give her it. Meanwhile, Byleth will try and get that chest. Be joking. Great, more hawks. Those feathery jerks are trying to take us out from both sides. You can see that again. The good news is, we made sure to not waste this. Give it a try. Giant bird's attention drawn. Jungle's down. We might get a little way just no in this. Bow alone. No time like the present. Really? Let's get to it. Then I'm just going to do this. Mithril. Ready and willing. What can I do? Pull out all the stops. There we go. Because we don't want to make sure that there is little attacks being thrown our way. away. Uh, alright. Okay, so we need to keep an eye on this. I got this. We're back. Who me? Four on. Leave it to me. Who, me? Ah, oh, we just seraphim. You were outmatched. And level twenty. Lysifia. Now you're... I'm gonna have to just literally evade them. Thankfully, the Mock Beast ain't that bad to deal with. And Claude... Really? More? More Hawks? The air's swarming with those feathered freaks. Let's get them before we fight the beast. Jesus. I thought we had one turn before they came in on the sleigh. Apparently I'm wrong. Ready anytime. Okay, let's move everyone out of the range. Just enough. Just enough so we can think of a counter attack. Think of a counter attack. Just enough. I stand ready. Because being honest, I need some time to think. Especially when we've got three hawks coming at us from the north and one from the west, I believe, or east. Okay, I think I know what I'm gonna do. It's gonna be a little risky. But hey. Now the time. Okay, it's gonna be stunned. Do 
do I have fuselage? Nope, I don't. Okay, so I'm going to do that here. No time like the present. I'm gonna break all three barriers. Gambit, where's my area? My area is not that bad. It's time. Assault. Yep, that's fine. Just got fiendish blow on. Giant bird. Got Avoid plus two. Draw attention away from them because I am not allowing my mages to be hit. Done the wolf, which is fine. <laughs> Done the bird, doing less damage. Hoping you went nuke. Okay, let's see if we can. Okay, hit you. So, can we hit you with cut and deal? Okay, yes, we can. So, let us do four on. To break you. to weaken you. Okay. So the good news is I knew. You Ignatz. Okay. I guess it worked out. Gambit. Sword. Yeah, no, I think I think you're gonna have to just to accept that claws getting this one.
pull back. Okay, so can we kill him one hit? No. That means I'm gonna have to give Lysipia. Nope, I guess I have to take this out. I don't need to worry about that. be having that attack four on I'm really sorry let us away leave it to me ready and willing or cash us yeah, Stand probably ready. just kill it with using Violet. There we go. There's Marianne. Okay. Should be fine. Deal. I got this. Let's get to it. I'll just use Leone. Yep. That takes care of that. That's all there is to know. And she got Triangle Town. Now I can talk about this. Oh, I've got away. Uh, but let's just say Triangle Tech is a little famous for what it does. Who? Me? Okay. Don't know if we're. Nope, I need to get up a bit more. Okay. First of all, assist. Warp. Over there. Nice. Chest. Knowledge gem. No, no, no. Uh, I'll put the killer lance into the convoy. What do I have? I've forgotten what. Oh, I don't. Oh, I do have a gambit. Okay. What gambits do I have? That was the question. Okay, so I have. Okay, so I should be able to shatter at least some of them. I've got another option. Which is what we want to do. Okay. 
Gambit. Everything is ready. Move out the way. Ready anytime. Shatter that. Be able to break it if we hit. And yes, I am t tapping it to death. Part of the reason is so Fling can get some experience. Uh, who's next weakest? That's Raphael, weirdly enough. He's gonna kill everyone. Marianne, at least damage-wise, is next, week, next weakest. Level-wise, she's up there. Let us put an end to its suffering. I think that is the most honorable thing we can do at this point. And Flame's catching up quite well. I am maturing at a rapid pace. Ah, yes. Flame. Maturing. Ooh. This honestly feels nice to give to Claude. But I also want to give everyone else experience. Do you think it was once a human? Like Miklon? No. It's not possible. Nice. Nice job, Claude. Progress suits me well. Nice. Nice job. Now we just got one more turn. Relax. Cutting you. It's gonna hit annoyingly, but at this point, it doesn't matter too much. Right. Oh, now I know what I should have done. Oof. Now you're trying to double with this. Oh, you're level 17, so yeah. Eighteen? Nice. Lawrence. I think Hilda should get this. did not go as planned. Let us return before any more hawks or wolves join us. But what was that demonic beast doing within the Red Canyon? <sighs> I was not wanting Claude's motivation to be maxed out. I was hoping for... I was also hoping for Hilda. Or Ignatz. Listen, Teach, no one likes aimless wandering more than me, but it's not worth dying over. Well, we're all okay now, so let's just focus on the positive. Ooh, 
Maybe we can tell folks back at the monastery that we came here for battle training, with our dear professor's permission. Hilda, <laughs> you scamp. No one has a knack for getting out of trouble quite like you do. It is a gift, milady. Oh, is that right? Well, no one can get into trouble quite like you, so it works out. Oh dear, I put us in a bit of danger there. <laughs> We are most fortunate that those delinquents followed us. You very nearly met your end. So did you. <laughs> what a marvelous professor you must be for all your students to be so concerned. I'm proud of us. Hmm. You seem more confident in your ability to teach. But that makes sense, as you have me to help you out. <sighs> How disappointing to have dived so deeply into danger, and yet to have nothing to show. Huh? What is this strange feeling? My memories. Do you feel them stirring? How curious. You seem to have grown stronger. And all thanks to our journey to Xanado. It really was worth all that effort. I found something. Huh? You found this? I dare say you may find a use for that. You should decide how best to use that thing. But wow, we got a lot out of this trip. It was a bother for a spell, but in the end, I feel we should think fondly of our little trip. We actually I don't think so. Time, wouldn't you say? <laughs> Divine Pulse maximum has increased, and we gained one Umbral Steel. I believe... I'll just show the beginning of this before we go to I am... end this episode, because I do want to show off one more thing. So, basically we just gotta defeat their leader, right? Then why don't we approach from... Uh, that won't work at all. Horses won't fit through there. I can't figure this out. I give up. <sighs> Shall we go over it one more time? But enemies never move how you want them to in a real battle, do they? I reckon I learned better on the battlefield. Professor, I need to speak with you. Ignat, you all right? I received a letter from my brother back home. There's some disturbing news. What's going on? Monsters have been attacking merchants within the Alliance territories. That happens all the time. I mean, that's how my parents died, so... Uh, Raphael. I didn't mean to bring up such a sensitive topic in your presence. Hey, don't worry about that. Come on. Let's hear the rest of it. Very well. These attacks seem to be focused on specific merchants. Like who? Those who are traveling from the territory of House Gloucester to the Regan Dukedom. Merchants traveling in the opposite direction, from Regan to Gloucester, don't suffer nearly as many attacks. That doesn't make any sense. Someone's got to deal with those monsters, though. Agreed. At this rate, my father and brother can't conduct business without risking their lives. Professor, could you assist me? I need your help exterminating these creatures. Now you're talking. I'm going too. I'm not learning anything in a classroom. You're gonna go, right, Professor? Don't you want to help these folks? We depart at once. Yeah, I knew you couldn't resist. Thank you so much, Professor. And Raphael, I can't begin to express my gratitude. And we find out what happened to Raphael's par parents. Oof. It's a surprise that he's able to be so jolly and smiling. <sighs> Come on. This isn't even our 
an online game in this way. Alright, so we actually want to go to the blacksmith and go to repair. Because I believe, yep, yeah, we can repair the sword of the creator. Which is probably what I wanted to do. Thanks a bunch. Interesting. Can I repair that? Even though it's a rusted axe. Hmm. Is that thanks a bunch? There we go. Everything else? Fine. All right, it's this way. Uh, before. All right, there's the longbows. They're now available. Armor Slayer. Slayer Plus. Oh yeah, we're starting to get into short axe ter territory. Is that the one? Thanks a bunch. And short spear territory. So let's give everyone is that a bunch? who uses these is that some of these before we end this episode. Come back. And let's look at the map. Split into two groups. Honestly, for this one, I probably want Catherine. And as an adjunct, probably. Probably want Manuela on Ignaz. But, we will actually. We'll actually, blah, 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 turn your word. We'll actually deal with this next time. So, next time on Let's Play Fire Emblem Three Houses, we're going to try and save these merchants. This is Inuzuma signing out.